Hi guys, it's Bonnie from BonnieLangFitness.com and I am currently driving to Calgary from the coast, from Vancouver. So, Mikey and I were out west for a friend's wedding reception. So, congratulations to Che Young and Chris. We're very happy for you guys and glad that we got to experience uh, your, your reception with you guys. I just thought I would check in with you guys as I'm driving here and um, vlog a little bit um, because my plans changed a bit this weekend and I want to talk about being flexible with fitness um, and also just looking at your priorities. So this weekend is my last weekend of 20 miles, my last really long run for marathon training. And you guys know that I'm training for my first full marathon in, um, on June 23rd in Banff. So it's coming up pretty quick here. And I was excited to try to squeeze this last run in and a little anxious about it because of the timeline of our driving out west this weekend. It was pretty packed, kind of a drive out for 10 hours, um, you know, connect with people, turn around, drive back sort of trip. So I was a little bit uh, nervous about how I was going to squeeze that in and ended up shifting it from Saturday morning. Um, just kind of in a random town that we stopped at along the way because I wasn't feeling well to Sunday morning, which was going to be in Vancouver. And from there, um, I ended up shifting it to tomorrow, to Monday morning. Um, and the reason is because I decided to, to choose to be with people instead of do my run. And I, I never ever want fitness to come before people, before friends, before family. Um, it's just not as much of a priority for me. But with this being my first marathon, I've been also really dedicated to training and, and thought, man, I can't skip this run. I ran a little bit less at Blend last week and so I thought, okay, well, if I ran less then, I really gotta make sure I get this 20 miler in and uh, was willing to get up at five to get it done. And it just, I ended up, um, just connecting with my sister-in-law and brother-in-law, which was great, and having pancakes with them, and, and then took off a little bit later today, and that brings me to now. So, instead of stressing about it and trying to get, you know, figure things out and shuffle cars around or uh, say yes to certain things and no to other things, I just made it simple and talked it over with Mikey, who gave me some good perspective about it, and decided that I'm gonna run tomorrow morning before work. Uh, Mondays I don't have to be until later, so it worked out okay. But I guess I just wanted to share that because everyone has to find their own level of what, how much fitness is going to be a priority to them. And even though training for a marathon is pretty high importance for me right now, I want to make sure that I get those miles in, that I feel confident, and kind of learn how my body works after not just going 10 or 15, but 20 plus miles. Um, I think you do have to decide at what cost. So it got me thinking about, well, can I ever train for something longer than this? Because really it does start to impact your life and your decisions. And I'm not sure if that's always a positive thing, at least not for me. So just some food for thought. I will be attempting my 20 milers for the third day in a row tomorrow morning. So you can check back and see um, on Tuesday how it goes. Um, in the meantime, Join a gorgeous ride. I'm out of the rain and into just some beautiful, beautiful weather here with the Rockies and uh, pretty happy to be be driving to, to Calgary because it's a great place to be. So if any of you want to ever come up and visit and take a run in the Rockies, let me know. And leave me a note in the comments um, just about your, your priorities. You know, where, where do you draw the line with fitness? Um, when it comes to friends, family, your other plans, maybe your, your social life, and, and how do you balance that? I'm lucky enough to have a job that's kind of flexible, so I, you know, I don't always have set hours like some people, so I'm going to try to squeeze it in tomorrow, but it was still a decision that I had to make this weekend, and I was glad to get even just a few snippets of time with people in, um, in instead. So, after sitting all day, I'll be running tomorrow. All right, you guys. Catch you later. I hope you had a great weekend and that you Americans have a good um, long Memorial Day weekend. And thanks for reading. Live well and be well. Bye.